why are women the weaker vessel? Now don't be confused by looking at women are weak, no, but a weaker vessel. God formed men in his fullness. Man wasn't lacking anything. Whatever God formed, it was full and not voided. Women became a secondary body from man to man and for man, not for self. If women are the weaker vessel, then where is the strong vessel? Man is. When there is no man, that weaker vessel will stay weak or be weaker or will have a sense to develop courage, willpower, and strength. Now when the word weak comes to mind, you see desperation, you see a great deal of lacking. Therefore, a woman has risen from that weaker vessel and organized their own agenda, feminist, to exclude themselves from being weak to someone who takes pride, honor, and self-worth. The idea of, I can do it by myself, I don't need anyone. The saying of, my mom did it without a man, I can too. Do you not know that your husband is on this planet as you are, sharing the same air as you breathe and waiting for you? A weaker vessel always getting taken care of with precision because women are precious. It's the man's duty to love his wife as God tells us. Now mistakes are going to occur, but the power of forgiveness annihilates useless errors in relationships. And you start to see that person in the eyes of God. Just because you're called the weaker vessel doesn't mean you're trash. It doesn't mean you're powerless or useless. It means that God took an incredible amount of time to design you and will present you as a present to a man who will cherish you as a priceless and precious vessel.